Welcome to B&B Reviews on this, our very first episode. Today we're going to a village called Peasmarsh in East Sussex and we're staying at the Horse and Cart Inn. So join us on our journey. Here's Theo and Michael's story in their own words. Our story started in 2016 when the previous owner asked us to come to the village of Peasmarsh. Together with our help, he reopened this lovely Grade 2 listed village pub, the Horse and Cart Inn in School Lane. When the Horse and Cart reopened in the summer of 2016, it had an overall refurbishment. After a year of hard work and a lot of effort from the team and us, we managed to put the horse and cart back on the Sussex hospitality map. Sadly, at the end of 2017, the previous owners were not interested in continuing with the pub and put it up for sale. With the help of local investors, the building was bought and we decided to continue the pub business as the Horse and Cart Inn. Dutch King's Day is the 27th of April 2018 was the official date of the takeover and continuation of this unique public house with four bed and breakfast rooms. The Horse and Cart Inn not far from the coast of Rye and the Garden of England, Kent. We are passionate about what we do. From the moment you step through the, our door, we make sure you are looked after by our team and us. Locally and beyond, we are known for our warmth and welcoming hospitality, exceptional food, wines, and locally brewed ales and beers. It all starts with us. Hopefully that will reflect on you our welcome guests and we have given you a taste of what East Sussex has to offer and welcome you many times after. The interior of the horse and cart is very warm and welcoming. With a large restaurant at the rear and also at the bar. With a large rear garden and seating area which is great on a sunny day. Now up to our room, which is called the King's Room. The King's Room is a nice size room, ample space, and obviously with a nice king size bed. ample tea and coffee making facilities, biscuits not included. The King's Room ensuite boasts of a shower and a bath. There's a large selection of wines to choose from. Mm -hmm. 
evening meal time and so much choice on the menu. Wash down with your favourite wine. A decent cup of coffee and a full English breakfast. What more could you want? Well, here we are after our night stay. We had a lovely meal in the restaurant uh, last night and we just had our breakfast, which was equally as nice. The bed was nice and comfortable. There was no noise from the bar. There was uh, no road noise. It was a very peaceful night. So now we get to the nitty gritty of giving it its marks and we categorize in four sections the first one is the welcome um, the second one is the room um, the third one is cleanliness and the fourth one is the meals and they start from one to ten and the, for the welcome we've given it a clear uh, ten because Theo gave us a, a great welcome and they're very friendly staff uh, it made you feel very um, welcome so we're given that a 10 on the room the rooms uh, an adequate size very very nice comfortable bed um, bathroom and a separate shower it was it's, it's it's lovely so we're given the room a nine cleanliness top marks 10 um, no dirt anywhere or anything like that and the meals we've given uh, a 10 as well so the overall score is 39 points. So it was very good. And we thoroughly enjoyed our stay here and uh, look forward to staying again. So hopefully you can join us on our next um, journey and see you then.